Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Arrowcraft. Well, in this episode, things are gonna get very interesting. However, before we get to that, in between episodes, I tried and organized our items here, and I think I managed to do it at least a little bit, and I think I'm happy with it for now. Now, today we're going to be doing multiple things. However, before we can do one of them, or any of it, we need to wait for nighttime so we can sleep. So I'll see you. Oh, <laughs> I'll see... I'll see you in the morning. Also, not gonna lie, that thing looks like something from Stranger Things. I'm not entirely happy with it. Now, for the first thing that we're going to do, I need to empty my inventory completely, except for a pickaxe, and I think with that I'm going to take a stone pickaxe, because I'm basically not expecting to live very long where I'm going. You can probably guess where I'm going, but, uh... Yeah, we're going to the nether. However, it is going to be a very quick trip. I was running, I made sure, <laughs> I had to make sure the guy wasn't following us. However, ooh, what's that? I didn't, that didn't used to be there, did it? Okay, that's actually a lot of iron. I should probably get that sometime. Um, anyway, yeah, it's not going to be a very long trip. It's going to be a very quick trip. Because I just want to get in, get four quartz so we can make a season clock, and then get out. However, it could very well be that I won't survive even going through. And make maybe making this portal in general will be a big mistake, but we are gonna find out in just a moment. I'm even gonna throw the flint and steel there. All I'm losing by going through is going to be my stone pickaxe. I don't even want to lose my ring. Whoa! Okay. Okay, okay, okay. This thing is impossible to fight off. That's not good. Okay, I haven't even gone through yet. Definitely gonna have to block this off, but here we go. Not waste any more time. Let's go through. I could very well die instant. Oh, wow. Okay, remove the fire, remove the fire. Okay, uh... Things look kind of safe, and I see quartz, so that is literally what I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get the quartz, hopefully four pieces, and then I'm getting out, because I'll die from the burning as well. But this place looks actually really cool, and it doesn't look to be not safe. It looks fairly safe, so that's good to know. Time to head back. We got four quarts. Mission accomplished. Actually, that went a lot better than I could have hoped for. Alright, get this. Run away, because I'm pretty sure things can spawn in the portal. It doesn't necessarily have to go through it. It can spawn on the other side as well. Okay. That actually didn't go too bad. And hopefully our healing pal over here is still around. No? Ah, oh. well, I guess I need to use my healing items then. Oh dear, it it hurt me run. Um, that's that's not ideal, is it? Not really in a shape of being able to take this guy on. But uh, let's try. Where are you at? Oh, can't hold my shield up. That's a problem. I might die here. Nope. Defeated. I'm not in a better shape than I was before, but <laughs> it's defeated. Ooh, and our sugarcane has actually grown. That's really good, because that means I can now make more water filters and also more healing items. However, for right now, I think water filters is the main thing that I need to focus on. Even though I, my head is currently not in a very good shape. I think I'm gonna wait till I have slept. Because I think you heal up a little bit when you sleep. Alright, well, with that done and said, let's go ahead and grab a redstone here. Pop it in here, surround it with quartz, and there we go, we have a season clock. And we are midsummer, which is why it is so incredibly hot. So that actually really explains a lot. Uh, if I go ahead and take a... Actually, maybe two leather. And I grab my saw. I think if I go ahead and combine these two. 
I think I want to make two item frames because then I can put a clock or a season clock on one of these and I should have a normal clock. I do not, so I'm going to make a normal clock. Not that I can't actually just look out the window, but it, you know, that's kind of... Wait, this says the day and time. Day 27, 2.20 p.m., day, daytime, season time, or session time, 17. Okay, that's cool. That's actually like a very cool one. And it says that right there when you just look at it. That's pretty cool. We've survived 27 days. Okay, well, everything just got bright because I'm close to one of those flying things. Did I just see something? No. Okay, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna wait till nighttime, and then we are going to be visiting... I don't know if I marked it down. I did not, but we do have a battle tower, uh, I think, over here somewhere. And I want to see... Oh, wow, I look weird. I want to see if it is something that we can potentially uh, loot. It could go very bad. It could go very good. We're gonna find out. But that thing should have a lot of spawners, which kind of is bad. But if I can get to it, those spawners will give me a ton of XP, which means I'll be able... Oh, that's not it. I'll be able to upgrade a lot of this stuff. So I guess I'll see you again in the morning. I actually went ahead and just bred these animals. Ooh, healer. And actually, I got a lot of levels, I feel, from that. Oh, man, there's two regeneration thingies. Heal me, please. There we go. Ah, that feels good. And it's going away. Of course. Good thing it has a friend. Also, I was told to farm, I believe, those fellas right there, which I definitely will. I just feel like that I need a bigger enclosure. <laughs> <laughs> and that is possibly something that I might set up in between episodes because I am pretty sure, yeah, they do they do give some really good meat, as I was told as well. Anyway, sun is setting. Like I said, I'll see you in the morning. All right, I am just gonna go ahead and make an extra iron rapier right here. And uh, yep, that's good because my current my old one is about to break and I don't want that happening mid fight so I actually think I'll just I bring it yeah I think I bring it what do you think I bring it you, you, no okay I, I I won't bring it <laughs> all right ladies and gentlemen we are off wow that's a lot of re regeneration thingies nymphs uh, could, could you guys like follow me to the battle tower that would be kind of nice. Actually, there is one thing that I don't want to bring, and that is my map, so I'm going to place that real quick. And I don't think I can run too much, because when I run, I get even hotter, which is not ideal, because I'm about to take a lot of iron armor on, you know, to take this place on, so this could be very interesting. A very bad time of doing this during the summer, apparently. However, it might be in the winter area, which would be cool. <laughs> pun not intended. Or maybe the pun was intended. No, it wasn't. But it could have been. Anyway, there it is. And I do need to be careful of that, but I... Hmm. I'm actually worried that I'm gonna get too close to it. Wow, actually, that is kind of close. But I'm gonna try and scale it from the side, so... This is gonna be interesting. Usually you take them from the ground up, but... This is kind of the ground level for us, so I'm gonna take it from the top down. Which is also going to make it a lot safer, but I'm pretty sure that also spawns a big guy at the top. So that is something that I'm kind of worried about. Okay, go in, quickly get rid of the spawners before anything can spawn. Get rid of that, like look at the levels. Oh no, yeah, yeah I'm very, very close to that thing. Okay, I cannot get closer, I cannot get closer to it. Okay, I'm being drawn in. Let's open this, get all the stuff. Oh, yes. This is very good. Okay, top spawners has been eliminated, and I definitely want to go ahead and use these levels while I have them, because I could very well die. All right, moving down to the second level. And the longer that I'm here, ugh, the more things will spawn. Poison, 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 poison. Whew. Okay. Oh, yep. Keep my distance. Okay. Uh, left foot. Right leg. Definitely want to make sure that my head is in intact. 
<laughs> okay, let's go again. Placing torches is also going to be key. Oh no. You're a special one. You're a special one. What on earth? Okay, it died. It died, it died, it died. We're good. Okay. Why did it have to be cave spawners? Oh no. My head, my head, my head, my head, my head. Please don't, please don't, please don't, please don't die, please don't die now. Dying here would be really bad. Okay. Whew. What is that? Bronze longsword. Huh. Well, that's interesting. I'm gonna be using a lot of healing items right here. Right foot, left arm, left leg. <laughs> I really don't want to die here. Okay, get a sip of water. However, the issue is the longer I stay up here. The longer, like... I give this bonus time to spawn things. You guys are an issue, though. I'm placing a good amount of blocks or lights, so that's always good. In the head. Oh, go away. Please go away. Okay. Okay, I do have slowness too, due to a couple of reasons. Haha! -ha. Oh, there's so many of you. The poison is what's killing me here, honestly. Yeah. Killing me quite literally. Having one of you guys around would be a big help. Maybe taking it head on is the wrong way of doing it. However, due to it being underwater, getting to the spawners from the side is kind of a headache. I can hope that because I've been away, that the spawners are now, or the mobs that was here are now gone. As I'm not hearing anything at the moment. I just hope I can get down here and get all my items fast enough. Okay. I got most of it. Okay, just a bunch of spiders. Oh, game, don't lag now, please. Okay, just get all these things. Please, bye. Where are my torches? Okay. Oh, nope. If I die in here, that's really bad. I don't know where my pickaxe is. Oh, no, nope, there's another one behind me. Okay, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. Block this, block this, block this, block this. I'm dead here. Yep. Especially if you hit me. I'm dead here, I think. I think I'm dead. No, I'm not. Oh, I'm in horrible shape, though. Oh my, where's my pickaxe? That is. Okay, this is really rough. <laughs> okay, sun is going down. I do have my sleeping bag though. Don't know where that zombie came from. It has to... must have come from below. I hope that when I sleep here, I'm going to heal most of my body through the sleep. However, I'm unable to rest here because monsters are nearby. Gonna have to go to the shore. Oh, you're an issue. You're a big issue. You're a big issue. Oh no, I can't swim up. I actually can't swim up. Oh wait, there we go. Okay. I'm gonna drown. Yeah, I'm gonna drown down here. Please don't drown. Please. Mm. All my items are gonna be underwater now. I will get through this, one way or another. At least I managed to kill it. Ooh. Like I was saying, at least I managed to kill it before I died. If I can just get that cave spider spawner gone, the rest I think will be a lot easier. Okay, I think I died over here somewhere. Yep, right by those squid. Oh yeah, right there. Alright, here we go. Dive down. Some of my things are actually still floating. That's actually kind of cool, but also kind of annoying. Okay. Get all my stuff. I can't get too close to the mermaid that's over there. Oh, you're a problem. You're a problem. You're a problem. Seriously. <sighs> At this rate, my items are gonna despawn. I really hope that thing is gone. Looks like it might be. Okay, quickly go in and grab the stuff. 
it's very difficult because I can't swim like in newer versions of Minecraft, so already now I need to head up, otherwise I'm gonna die from drowning because my head takes too much damage. Like there. And I don't have any wood that I can make doors with. Wait a minute though, torches? I really don't want to use vanilla torches, but torches... Actually, doors will be easier, doors will be better. I just really don't want my items to disappear. And I might be dead again. As long as I don't run, I should be good. Okay, here we go. Go underwater. Place the doors. Like this. And we are good. I hope. Now I just need to go and get the stuff from down here. So that is just another door that I need to place. Like so. And I cannot get any closer to the mermaid, so get this stuff. Don't press control, because then I'll die. <laughs> Go up to this door, get a breath, then get all these things. Okay. If you ever die in the ocean, doors seem to be the way to go. Yep, actually, we needed that. Get the final items, I think that's it. Head to the surface. Okay, I got everything apart from my other iron rapier, which I don't know where it went, but I think I can live without it. Now I do have torches, I do have everything that I need in order to proceed. So I think I'm just gonna stick with my vanilla sword and then go in, hopefully get the spawner. I might actually be able to punch a hole through this? Question mark? I wonder, would that work? Yes. Please, get rid of... Don't... My sight keeps being taken to the mermaid. Okay. Got it, got it, got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. Please, stop looking in that direction. I might die again. Nope, I'm good. I don't have any healing, though. If I can get a little bit of wood. No wood. Food. But no wood. Okay. Oof. Okay. That mermaid is really making this difficult. Because when I'm in there, it forces me to look towards it. And that really messes up everything. I'm gonna go home for the night. Make more healing. And then be back. That way, whatever mobs have spawned in there, will also hopefully despawn. I cannot run though because that thing is gonna come and get me. Also, I do have six levels. Can I use those for anything? Gather magic. Yes, and I believe gathering as well. Yep. You wanna use those levels while you have them. This is probably a good opportunity to empty the inventory as well. Make a bunch of bandages. As many as I can possibly make. 16 should be good. Actually, no, bringing all of them. And then back to it. I'm actually gonna go ahead and grab a bunch of stone here. I hope 33 in total is gonna be enough because then I might be able to make a little bit of a bridge potentially. I don't know if that's gonna work though. I think it will, hopefully. I could, by the way, be wearing earplugs, but that would take away my uh, my armor for my head, which would be really bad in this very specific situation. I need more stone. All right, second floor, or I should say next floor, because technically that was second floor, I think. Anyway, we're going to run in there right now. I hear a baby zombie. Yep, that's a paper zombie, that's a paper zombie, that's a paper zombie. Lead them out here, and fighting is a lot easier when up here. Okay. Place a bunch of this down. That's a skeleton. Ow. The left arm. I can take the left arm. Feed you. Oh. Okay. Break this. As quickly as possible. Break you. Okay. Oop. Oop. 
<laughs> my head. Ooh, wolf armor. Okay, that's a lot of cool stuff in here. Melon seeds, I'll take that. I don't like those sounds, though. I'm maybe gonna take all this. Alright. Quick break. I think I might remove this. Making it a little bit easier. Okay. 19 vanilla torches. That's actually huge in uh, in our old craft. Okay. That one was a little bit easier. Now we can go in skills. I can... I just probably... What does it take to use diamond stuff? We don't have diamond at the moment. So level 16. I should probably get eight, everything up to 8. Because that seems to be what I need to get in order to get to basic usage of things. All right. Uh, let's take a quick break over here. I'm really happy I made this bridge, actually. It makes it a lot easier. Quick lunch break, you know. Okay, back in. Hopefully some of the mobs has um, despawned. Now we're getting to the tricky part, so we're getting to the point where I can't just walk in as fast. I need to go. Okay, that chest has a... Okay. 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 That's a problem. Me looking away like that is a big problem. Hello. Oh, well. I see something else in the corner. I see something else in the corner. Oh, hello. That mermaid is a pain. They do have a little bit of armor, but I don't think it's enough. <laughs> okay, uh, let's try again, I suppose. Oh, you. I hate you. I don't know where it went. Outside? On the ground? Oh, right here. Oh, nope, nope, you are not killing me. You are not killing me. Look at my head. That's an ender pearl. I might want that. Okay, and spent levels, spent levels. Oh, can't yet. Need more. <laughs> you know what? I'll spend it for gathering. There we go. I do actually. Am I full? No, I'm not. Pick it up. Oh, thank you. Okay, I wasn't recording, but I just saw something jump up the ocean and then down again. I don't know what I saw. It could have been just that. Also, what is that? Okay, I'm seeing things. Okay, those are skeleton spawners. That's gonna be interesting. Ooh. Actually, this is going to be very interesting. This could be relatively easy. Granted, I can get some torches in, and I don't get shot in the head. Place torch. Wow, that's a lot of them. That's a lot of them. <laughs> Left arm. They're coming up. Quickly. Okay, this might be easy, because my shield is tanking a lot with. Ow. Oh no, that's a special guy. That's a special one. That's a special one. Okay. The longer I stay right here. Uh, rare singing skeleton of something. Oh, I can hit you from here. Oop. Oop. Please die. Gotcha. Okay. Baby zombie. I hate baby zombies. I hate baby zombies. I hate baby zombies. Okay. My head is good. As long as my head and body is good, I should be good. This is a lot. Are zombie zombies crawling? No, 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 no. This is not okay. Okay, all these zombies just... 
coming up from another level. And I'm pretty sure there's one with like thorns or something. Not too cool. It is also nighttime, so I'm gonna try get my sleeping bag. Get to the roof. Oh dear. Yep, sleep if I can. Okay, I think we're good. There are so many zombies. Ooh, wait a minute. 16 levels. 16 levels. I'm not risking this. 16 levels. 16 levels. That is a lot. We can get gathering up to 8. We can get magic. Oh, almost magic up to 8. Building. Do I need building up? Agility. I guess I'm gonna get that up. Okay. I gotta remember to use the spear as well. It is really powerful, even though I have mining fatigue while holding up the shield. Then it's really powerful, actually. Okay. Here we go again. Oh. Uh oh. Okay, I think I need to. I think I need to leave and then come back again. The issue is those zombies are coming from a different level, and when I hit one, it is like calling all the other ones to come as well. So I really hope they're kind of gone now. The level that I want to attack is just skeleton spawners, which should be easy enough. But the zombies make it very difficult. Okay, a bunch of them are attacking each other. Get that in there. I got a crossbow. Hold up. Hold up. Can I load this with normal arrows? Uh, high damage and long range requires loading before firing using uses bolts. Okay. That's good to know. Oh, wow. We can make a bunch of different arrows. Okay, there's a final enchanted skeleton right there. Which we just need to get rid of. Oh. I think we're good. Okay. I think... I think. Oh, nope. There's one left. One left. Get over here. Come on. Oop. Win lives. Doesn't stop. Oh, let them fight. Let them fight. Yes. Do the work for me. It just healed somehow. I don't like that. Please come over here if you can. Yeah. Ha ha. Okay, break this. Block that. Block all of these. Get rid of this. ASAP. Okay, oh, hello. You gotta be kidding me. <laughs> that guy headshot at me. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna need a weapon to take it out. Okay. Uh, but you know what? That that floor is now taken. I covered all the holes. I covered the entrance. Everything should be safe down there. However, I don't really know how many levels I had on me. I might have just wasted like maybe seven, eight levels or something. Yeah, because I just destroyed the spawner. Oops. All right, here we go though. This is not wet. No, no, mm -mm. I really don't like that mermaid. Here we are though, and the skeleton is actually gone. It despawned. Okay, so with that, I can equip this, this, and everything else back. Now, this chest is locked, and I'm pretty sure... Lock... Pick? Golden lock pick. I assume we need something like this in order to... Or maybe an iron lock pick. They're actually not that expensive. I really want to try and get in there, so I think it's worth me leaving and coming back right after putting something in these holes so I don't fall and die, because that would be pretty bad. Yeah, I'll go back home with all of this loot right here. The hot dust, what can I use that for? Hot crystal shards. Increases maximum health. Oh, the hot dust is really important. Okay. So on its way down, I'll go home, and I'm gonna come back with some different lockpicks. All right, here we are. I thought that was a mob for a second. Uh, I guess I will take all the loot that I can have. Okay, I have five iron lockpicks and four gold lockpicks. I don't know if the... Oh, wow.
Okay, this is... More advanced than I... I thought it would be. <laughs> okay, Iron Lock Pig might be stronger. Okay. What? What? Uh... I, I don't understand. Click? Is there like a f sequence to this? Okay. I don't understand that. I need to do some research. But guys, I am running out of time for this episode. So I'm going to call it there. We went to the nether. We got another quartz. We got a season's pass. Which I'm really happy about. And then we defeated like one, two, three, four four floors including the top one and it has been pretty good we will be continuing with this in the next episode uh i really wanted to open this chest but um that is apparently not something that i am at the moment capable of doing so i need to do some research on how to do this also guys if you have any suggestions on how i can run um basic basically these towers in a better and more efficient way please do let me know down below in the comments but like i said that's gonna be it for this one i really hope you have enjoyed if you did be sure to leave that like button leave a like on that like hit that like button also i want to see if we can reach 7500 subscribers before the end of the year so if you haven't subscribed yet make sure you do but guys that's gonna be it for this one really hope you enjoyed and i hope to see you in the next one have a wonderful day and goodbye i really hope these mobs are not here when i log back in <laughs> Oh dear.